angry. Because if it's true, then it's horrible. Nobody should have, have that demise. Friends leave photos and flowers outside Staten Island mother Janine Camerata's home last night after days of searching for her. Once I found out she was missing, I, like, my, my gut told me something is terribly wrong. Thursday morning, police discovered burnt human remains inside this storage facility on Arden Avenue. The investigation taking a turn into a murder investigation. The 37-year-old mother and teacher was last seen Saturday night after telling loved ones she was going to see her children at her estranged husband's home in Queens. Janine and Michael Camerata were in the midst of an ugly divorce and custody battle. She came to me Friday telling me the good news. The husband was going to give her the kids and she was on her way to pick up the kids. When Janine didn't show up for either of her two jobs at PS29 or this Staten Island Dollar Tree, friends frantically texted and messaged her on Facebook, but say responses were cryptic and uncharacteristic. Wednesday, Michael Camerata was arrested and charged with assault and stalking. We're working with the Staten Island District Attorney to establish you know, probable cause and, and justification to charge him with murder. Sources say police are reviewing two key surveillance videos of a man who resembles Michael with what appears to be an accomplice, transporting a large, heavy bag from Queens to this storage facility. Police still have not found Janine's 2017 white Chevy Cruze that looks like this one, with license plate HSK 8417. Now, latest information from police sources say they do believe the estranged husband's girlfriend was the accomplice in that surveillance video helping to transport a bag to that facility on Staten Island. Now, as for the estranged couple's children, police tell us they're now in protective services. We're in St. George, Staten Island. Natalie Dudrich, CBS 2 News.